Monday first Monday vlog and it is 11 17 on a Sunday for me so I'm cutting it close because I need to record and edit this video today so it's probably gonna be a little short but I have some things I have to do so at least I'll be doing things right now I'm at Kroger's because I have a short little list of things I want to get just for the week like I don't need a lot of food because I went grocery shopping a while ago but I want to make a meatloaf because I have some potatoes I need to eat. So I'm gonna get some ground beef and green peppers because that's what I need. And then a lemon and a salad kit because I want to have a salad today. And then a lemon meringue pie. That's what's on the list today. Let's see if I walk out of there with just those things or do I pick up anything extra? It's so hot. It's 84, but I think my car is just hot because my windows aren't tinted and I never put the foil thing in my window but this Kroger's parking lot is packed so I'm gonna run in I'm gonna be listening to my book as I shop and then we're gonna hurry up and get out of here and get back home because I haven't eaten today and the longer I'm in that store the more foolishness I might pick up so we gotta be quick it is so hot <laughs> I it's 1138 so I didn't spend much time in the store I got exactly what I was supposed to get but I did get one extra thing but I'll show it to you guys when I get back to the house because I'm gonna die in this hot car we have to go home and make an iced coffee back home and I'll show you guys what I got I got a Caesar salad chopped kit Banana pep, green pepper, a lemon. I found the lemon meringue cakes, lemon meringue pies. They actually had them in the freezer section in the, in the bakery. So I have this one and it's gonna have to thaw out. So put that to the side. I got a ground beef for my meatloaf. And the extra thing I bought because it looked really good was these bacon wrap jalapeno peppers with cream cheese. Thought these would be really good in the air fryer as a little snack for later. But right now, I'm on to make me a coffee and I kind of want to chill, but I kind of need to be productive and I need to clean up because oops, I don't have a trash bag in my can because I took the trash out but I oh look he had a birthday Friday he is one years old but um I bought a record player and some speakers and I want to put them away and right now they're just sitting up here I want to put them here so I need to take everything off from here so the record player and everything go there, the speakers, and then this shelf is a mess. So I need to address that today. But right now it's time for coffee. Now I saw the, her name is not Kayla, it's Cameron. The Cameron coffee girl on TikTok. She made a peanut butter coffee and she used this and I'm like, I have some of that. So it's just powdered peanut butter because I bought the Kaya chocolate peanut butter syrup and it tastes like chemicals. It's disgusting. But the Kaya chocolate toasted marshmallow syrup is good. So I'm just like, it's hit or miss with the brand. And so now I just, I'm scared to buy anything from them because I need consistency. So we're gonna try the peanut butter powder and the way she made it is like she put it in like a little cup and used one of these little things and blended it up so that's what I'm gonna do and I'm actually gonna use this cold brew that I already have in the fridge that I got from Walmart because I don't feel like brewing any coffee so that's what we're gonna do this is the mocha cereal 
Tim Hortons cold brew that I got from Walmart. tablespoon is so we have half a tablespoon all right so we have two tablespoons of water and then we're gonna do one tablespoon of the or yeah one let's see how it goes with half for now let's see what the half does don't tell me this thing is dead oh my god it's dead hold on Ugh. have to charge this really quick how unfortunate okay hopefully it's charged enough now so I can use it okay I think we need a little bit more peanut butter powder just like that much okay I should have did milk instead of water now that I'm thinking about it but next time and I'm actually gonna pour my coffee into this cup too. That way I know it's gonna get all mixed together. All right, that should be good. And then just pour it over. little bit of chocolate drizzle I'm using the cookies and cream to Ronnie because I don't have a dark chocolate that's open Do a lot of milk excited to try this just because of the peanut butter Ooh. That's good. And the peanut butter. I was worried that it was gonna separate. You know how some things like separate and get real weird on the top? I don't see any weird peanut butter separation. I feel like this could be sweeter. Let me go look at syrup side. I have a chocolate chip cookie dough, maybe like a pump of this. Just like a pump. I think a pump is only half a tablespoon and a serving size is two tablespoons I think I should probably measure that that's so good with the peanut butter where's my okay let's test to see how much one pump is because this is half a teaspoon or half a tablespoon oh it's not even a full half okay All right, so one pump isn't even half a tablespoon. I usually do like two to three pumps. So I guess if I'm rounding up, I'm doing a tablespoon and a half. That's so good. I'm actually gonna sip on this and clean up. I was actually gonna make a salad with this coffee, which seems like a very dangerous combination um but we're gonna risk it anyway because i need something to like give me some energy while i'm sitting around this coffee is gonna be good but it's not gonna keep me full it's just gonna like make me think i'm full and in an hour i'm gonna be like i'm not i'm not i'm not full but i'm making a little salad kit but i want to make some lemon chicken so i'm gonna throw some like two pieces of chicken in the air fryer Maybe three, so I can have some today and tomorrow, because this is like maybe two days of salad kit, maybe. It's so small, it looks like only one day of salad, honestly, but I have other food to eat if the salad is. I love just having a bag of chicken tenderloins, 
way better than just buying like I guess I could buy a bag of chicken thighs maybe I'll do thighs next time but I just think tenderloins are just so convenient because it's just like you make one or two and you could do so much with them like I love them but throw these in the air fryer it's so confusing because my screen on my camera is flipped because I don't have a screw for it to sit straight up so it keeps flipping the image and it's confusing me I don't know how to hold the camera in row like because the image is reversed but I'm gonna make it to a not a hardware store but some sort of camera repair I can't even talk some sort of camera repair place so that I can Get the get a screw hopefully my air fryer is so dirty yikes maybe I should have did grill well I don't have the grill tray in there so we're doing air fry put this in there. Right. I need to see how long it's gonna take for this thing to thaw so I can eat it It absolutely does not say. All right, so I guess we're just gonna assume before I go to bed, I can have a slice of this. So maybe like, I don't know, five hours or something. It'll be longer than that. It'll be thawed in five hours. About time I have dinner and I'm ready to have dessert. Oh, this camera. I wanna get a new camera, but I don't know if I should even get a new camera. Like, am I, I mean, I. Like, should I even be buying a new camera for this vlog channel, even though this camera still works fine. I just need a camera screw, but it's just, I don't know. I need to be cleaning. I need to get up and clean, but I just want to sit down for a second, maybe for like, so good. <sighs> Okay, let me put you guys on a different tripod and then, oh my gosh, I keep trying to like get the camera right and because like I'm having such a hard time with this flipped camera, the frustration alone will make me want to buy a new camera. I'm trying to resist, but Canon has a new like little mini camera. It's so cute and it has its own stand and I feel like, and I could add my own microphone to it and I feel like I would just be so much happier if I had a different camera. This one makes me so mad now. Um, yeah, let me switch tripods and we're going to tackle this shelf today. We're being productive because I do need to edit this video today so I can have it up for tomorrow. Well, Monday. Oh, there's bubble wrap in here. Can you guys see yourselves in the can? Oh, you kind of can. It's okay. This is actually the mirror from my Mirrored Entertainment Center. Um, the Mirrored Entertainment Center went to the trash and I didn't know the top glass piece came off, so I decided to keep that. So that's what we got here, but it's so dirty. I think this looks really good. I guess I'll put my candy back right here. And then another day I will address what's going on at the very top of the shelf. I had to put this in here because it was sitting on top of the entertainment center and for whatever reason, Ramsey kept putting his paw in it and pulling it down. I put it back and he'd just do it again. So he has some sort of issue with this thing. And so it's in here for safety. <sighs> yeah. Very cute, I have my three records. I feel like I had a wedgie that whole time I was recording, so I'm probably gonna have to edit around that. Um, it is so hot in my apartment. I have my air on 74, and yet it feels like it is cooking in here. Probably because I'm moving around a bunch and my hair is on my neck. So 
we're gonna have to do that but wearing a ponytail gives me a headache i feel like i wear a ponytail and then by midday i have a headache so i have to take my ponytail out chicken looks okay it was frozen maybe i should cut a piece in half to make sure it's okay hold on let me check what are you guys doing Let's check and see. Nope, it's fine. All nice and cooked. Um, I forgot to season this chicken. Like I didn't put any seasoning on this. So I'm actually gonna put some seasoning in there now and then douse it in lemon. Haven't really got a chance to enjoy my coffee because I'm doing stuff. Ramsey's sitting here patiently thinking he's gonna get chicken. He's patiently waiting though. Here, get you guys some treats. You want treats? Come on. Come on. Yeah. I'm just gonna do lemon, salt, and pepper because whatever. Oh, it was kind of hard to find a lemon that was not green today at Kroger's and this was the only one I can find and it is stiff. I got these plates for Ramsey's birthday, so we're going to use one of these. And we're going to try to squirt as much lemon as we can out of here. Love lemon chicken on a Caesar salad. So good. Uh oh, a little bit of chicken escaped. Get back in there. Ooh. Oh my God. Very lemony and delicious. Actually, got Ooh, yikes. Cut this up a little smaller pieces. <sighs> and then I'm gonna chill. I don't feel like making my salad right now. I feel like just drinking my coffee and sitting on the couch, so. We will get back to salad time in a second, but at least my meat is cooked. Oh, now the air wants to kick on after I'm starting to cool down already. Cleaning up my mess. They've run around, they've had treats, and now they're feeling good. It's, oh. He's not done, but everybody else is feeling good. And now, right, Pia? This wind got in his tunnel. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I'm gonna finish putting my candy back on the shelf and then I'm gonna sit down for a little bit. It's two o'clock. I don't know what happened. Me and Pia got too cozy on the couch, but I did finish my coffee. And I did finish cleaning up that shelf. Ooh. Oh, I've been sitting on my foot this whole time. Okay, it's okay. Okay, look how good it looks. Top shelf, little knickknacks. My grandma bought this for me a long time ago. It actually works. You wind it up at the bottom and he spins around and he sings a little song. So cute. Got all my extra coins for my laundry. Oh, this is me as a baby. Don't look at my chest breast, but. Yeah, I'm wearing a wig. I got a little extra candy that I have not eaten yet, but I will. More candy, which I've had forever. These are so old and stale because I bought them a long time ago and I was really into fruities at the time and then I didn't eat the fruities. All this candy I've had for a while. It's like I like having the candy, but I never eat it. So this stuff has all been here for a while. Got my books. My little mermaid book down here. I have my game. These are my game guidebooks. This is the new Animal Crossing one, the old one, and the Stardew Valley guidebook, which is, there has to, there has to be another one coming out soon because there's gonna be a, an update to Stardew Valley. So I'm looking forward to getting a new book. And then the record player is out all nice just open this up put a record in 
and hit start and it's going to play the song. I got my records looking all cute. All the cat's toys. I always put their toys inside of here and then one of them will go in here and dig all the toys out and then I have to throw them all back in here. But it just makes it a little easier, tidier to look at. <sighs> I guess it's time to make that salad now. My lemon meringue pie is coming along, it looks good. It's still really cold at the bottom, so I think it's still frozen, but that has to be close to being done. Oh wait, before I do salad, battery starts flashing. Hold on, let me switch this battery out and I'll show you. Okay, excuse the mess, but I didn't show you guys I got a new rug in the living room and I got a new entertainment center. <sighs> um, where's the remote? On the floor cat must have got to it let me show you guys what it can do it has fire oh my gosh and I can change the color of the fire and I can change the color of the lights anyway and all right focus I can turn the heat on Pia likes it so in the winter time, I can sit by my fireplace in the living room and it puts out heat. It's so cute. You can turn the heat up. How do we, okay. I don't know how to turn it off. Okay, I think it's off now that it's gonna cool down. But that's so cute. I love this fireplace. I have been looking at this fire, this entertainment center for probably about two years, maybe more. I've always wanted it and I never got it because I was just like, I don't need it. It's okay. But now I have it and I love it so much. I'm so happy. I just feel like it brings like the whole space together. Um, oh, look at Pia. I was putting heat out and now she has her little paw right there because she's like, why? That was warm and I liked it. I'm gonna turn it back on for her. Even though I don't want the heat on, I'm not going to. She's cute, but she's not that cute. I'm not turning on the heat for her. She wants me to though. <laughs> I don't know what she thinks. <laughs> Are you confusion? Big confusion. Okay, and I'll show you what's in the cabinets. So here we have my PlayStation 4 and my PlayStation 4 games. And here I have all my controllers. So this is the PlayStation controller, Switch controller, extra cords and chargers and stuff. And this one I just have Bath and Body Works, the little warmers, and then the candles. And then this one I think is just random crap. Like you don't need to see it. It's just crap. And then the switch is here. Looking cute. I'm actually going to leave that on because that's cozy. I'm like winded. I'm going to put you guys back on the tripod really quick. It is salad time, and then I think I'm gonna do like a quick edit of this video, and then I'm gonna play Animal Crossing for the rest of the night. I'm reading a book. Um, I think her name is Jillian Flynn. It's the lady who wrote Gone Girl. Um, I'm rereading her books because right now all the books I have on hold at the library aren't available. So I need, I'm just rereading things at this point. So I wrote, I read Gone Girl and Sharp Objects, and she has another one. So they bought dark objects. A lot of her books are very similar. Like, I like them, but they're all very similar. So I am reading Sharp Objects, and then once I get done reading Sharp Objects, I'm gonna go ahead and watch the show on HBO Sharp Objects because I watched that before and I liked it. So that's what I'm doing. And I've been playing a lot of Animal Crossing. I'm back on the wagon. I've been playing since Friday. I'm back. I'm into it. I, it's, it's a good game, actually. Um, and I'm playing like normal Animal Crossing. I'm not even playing Happy Home Paradise, I believe it was called. I'm not even doing that. I'm just playing plain old Animal Crossing, just decorating my island. And Pietro, he's like, I haven't seen you in 10 months. I'm like, 10 months? 
I I just find it hard to believe that I haven't played Animal Crossing in 10 months. I just don't think I was talking to him in that 10 month time frame, but I'm pretty sure I was on there. I just didn't talk to him. But anywho, yesterday I went to this Mexican restaurant because I saw somebody on Instagram post that they had birria talk or birria quesadillas. So I went. Why was a birria quesadilla with rice and beans $24. I went ahead and bought it, but I was salty, like $24. The most I want to spend for like a meal, like $12 to $15. And I feel like I got a lot of extra things. I didn't get it just a meal. I got some extra things with it. Like I upgraded my drink and maybe got an extra side. And I plan on pigging out. Like that's normal like I think the last time I went to Popeye's I spent like maybe $15 probably less than that but yeah 24 is crazy I was not happy but I have leftovers and I'm gonna eat it for like two days um probably more I might have like one full day and maybe one like snack day left of food hey excuse me excuse me in the refrigerator get out go um yeah that's disgusting what am I in here for nothing because my salad kit is on the counter <sighs> that just threw me off now the AC's on and we're gonna eat our salad in this cute little Hello Kitty salad plate bowl thing that I got from TJ Maxx. I love bowls that are shaped like plates or plates that are slightly shaped like bowls. These are the best. All right, let me throw this together really quick. got our nice salad here it came with bacon and I didn't realize I bought one that had bacon bits in it I don't remember seeing that on the bag but there was bacon in there so I put it in here if I had some avocado I would have put that in here too I think this is where I plan on being for the rest of the day it is 2 15 I wanted to see a movie today but I don't think that's happening. I'm tired of going outside in the heat. I might wait to see a movie on Tuesday when I leave work. We'll see how I feel. But yeah, I'm going to listen to my book, watch a show, play my game. For dessert, I'm going to eat a little bit of that lemon meringue pie. And I'm just going to chill. All right, just so I can make sure I have this video edited and up before I lose... Um, the will to do so <laughs> i'm gonna end the vlog here if you made it this far leave a lemon emoji and i will see you guys next monday i have a longer vlog that i need that i already have recorded it um i have a longer vlog that i already have recorded but i have not edited it yet so at least hopefully if i stay on track i'll always be a week ahead for myself <sighs> but it'll be a longer one so Okay, see you guys. Bye.